They got me thinking. Wow, The Rock beat me to it. That's a pretty crazy sentence when you say it out loud. And it's been a pretty crazy evening for everybody here, I would say. Yeah. I mean, for crying out loud, we just saw the head of the table go face to face with The Rock. Yeah. But I'm gonna let you in on a little secret, Birmingham. That's not why tonight was special. Because as crazy as what I'm about to say might sound, it's the truth. We are super, super lucky to have the biggest star, maybe in the history of the business, The Rock, come back to WWE. But trust me when I tell you, The Rock is just as lucky to have WWE. And when I say that, I mean every single one of us in the back, whether it's Sami Zayn or Drew McIntyre, or it's Cody Rhodes, or it's Seth Rollins, or it's Becky Lynch, or it's The Bloodline. Right now, you have the best crop of wrestlers in decades. Yeah. And this isn't just special for you. It's special for all of us. Because for years and years and years, our generation, the guys that have been busting their ass night in, night out, we have to constantly listen to people talk about the good old days. The good old days. The good old days. Well, I got news for you. Tonight, 10,000 people sold out this building yeah. in Birmingham. Yeah. To see the best crop of performers in the world. So I have news for you and for everybody. The good old days are right here, right now. Yeah. And I want to thank I want to thank you for letting me a part of it, and I thank you all from the bottom of my heart, each and every one of you, for being a part of it with us. Yeah. Thank you so much. We are all doing something special right now. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah. I love you. Thank you very much.